Welcome back to Swing Like a Gorilla. I'm your host, The Diesel, and today we actually have some real golf. So in today's video, we are at the club at Brookstone in the upstate of South Carolina. Now, this is the first round of 2022 for me. I have not played since before Christmas. So today we're going to take a humble approach and see if we just can't shoot somewhere in the 70s. Anything under 80 today is going to be okay. So we start off at hole number one, 397 par four, slightly downhill, straight forward. Should be a nice, easy starting hole. Let's find out. Our first swing of 2022, and he pulls it a little bit. Not too bad, still gonna end up in the fairway. All right, nice leave. Left side of the fairway leaves me at 115 in. Just a little gap wedge. See if we can't draw it in there. And it's a green in regulation off the bat. We are technically on the dance floor. However, from where we are, I'm not sure we can hear the band. So let's just grind a little bit, see if we can't two putt for the first par of the year. Got about a 30 footer for birdie. Honestly, really not trying to make it, just trying to nestle up there tight and have a tap in par. And let's give this a whack. Left it about three feet short on the amateur side, unfortunately. A little timid on that one, but no problem. Grind a little bit, tap it in. First par of the day. Nice par, David. I'll take 18 of them all day long. Hole number two, across the street, actually under the bridge. So we got 419 yards. It plays uphill and a little into the wind. This is going to be a little hefty. Let's see if we can't find another fairway. All right, another pull. Let's hope this doesn't become a trend. Did find the left side of the fairway. Left myself about 175 yards up the hill. I told you this is going to be a hefty one. We got zero roll out of that driver. Let's see if we can't find another green in regulation. Flushed it, hit it well, but came right over the top and hold it. Should be close to about pin high. That didn't take long. Hole number two, and I have to test my short game. Goal here, chip it up close, tap it in, make my par, and move on. Let's see if we can pull it off. A little timid on the chip. Left it about 10 to 12 feet short. So now I've got an up the hill, left or right breaker. This is going to be a grinder. Ooh, right across the edge. Let's go tap this bogey. After two holes in the books, we are plus one. I knew I wasn't going to make all pars today, but yeah, I was hoping it was going to last a little longer. Hole number three is a beastie par three at 223. It is a little downwind, so I'm going to see if I can't get a five iron there. Might not be thinking it's a little chilly out. I'm not sure. Let's give it a shot. shot tracer malfunction and a swing malfunction left that out to the right and definitely short short game test number two again trying to nestle this up close and tap it in for a par see how we do a little more aggressive this time hit it past the hole about 15 feet and again got a grind coming back Really don't want back-to-back -back bogeys here. Come on, grind a little bit. Hey, if you're enjoying this, don't forget to get down those comments and hit subscribe. Hit like. Doesn't cost you a dime. Helps me out tremendously. All right, another left or right breaker. Got about 15 feet coming back up the hill. Sneaking, sneaking, sneaking. Ooh, just snuck it in. Hole number four is a short par five. First par five of the day. Let's see if we can't take advantage and get that bogey back. 468 yards. This fairway does slope severely from left to right. I am trying to hit it on the left side. I did pull it a little bit, but I think it's going to work out just fine. A ball rolled all the way to the right-hand side of the fairway. It leaves me about 185 yards, playing closer to 195. Uphill. Let's see if we can't get a six iron. Ooh. Bottom groove, got about six feet off the ground. Did get it on the green, rolled over the back. I am about four to five feet off the green. Let's see if we can't chip this close and make a birdie. Not bad. 
bad. Dialing it in. Got that to about three feet. We are in grind mode. Come on, birdie. There it is. Back of the jar. First one of the day. Back to even par. Let's see if we can't keep this momentum going. Hold number five, 342 yards. It is short par four, but a tricky little green, if I remember right. And I pulled another one. The phone was going off in the background. I'd love to blame that, but I really can't. Barely kept that one in play. Do have a tricky little shot. Only have 125, but if you can see that trillium right in front of me, I've got to keep it below that. I've got a wedge in the back of my stance. You should have spent a day at the beach, get some sun. This short-sided bunker is severely below the level of the green. I'm just trying to get it up there about three or four feet. Ooh, landed that one just where I wanted to, but rolled out to about six or seven feet, unfortunately, above the whole slick little downhill left or righter. Timid scared putt down the hill, just missed the par putt. Let's go attempt this bogey in for a PBFU. After five holes, we are back to plus one. Now on to hole number six, 530 yard par five. Made a slight little swing correction. Hit this one really good, down into the valley. Not gonna get really much roll down here. I've got 275 yards of the flight stick. Ball is slightly below my feet. All right, came up a little short just on the other side of the bunker. Gonna have to hit a little modified flop shot, see if I can't get this on the green. Goal accomplished, got myself about a 20, 25 footer left here for birdie. Again, just trying to nestle this up close and tap it in, take my par and get on to the next hole. Six holes in the books, one over par. On to hole number seven, another long par three, 213 yards. Nowhere to miss this green. Yeah, let's see what we do. Swing correction, over swing correction. Hung this one out to the right. This is going to leave a uphill tough chip. Another green severely above my head. So far up, you can barely see the top of my head, and I am 6'3". What do I do? I leave this short, barely get on the green, almost rolls back to me. I still have about 15 to 20 feet up the hill, trying to salvage my car. Roll that just past the hole to about 12 inches. Tap that in for a bogey. We are now at plus two, heading into hole number eight. Hole number eight is 425 yards downhill. Fairway runs out. We're just gonna hit a little three wood down to the bottom of the hill. See if we can't get us a good landing spot. Sit pretty good in the middle of the fairway. Got 155 yards of the flag. I'm going to try and finesse an 8 iron up there to see if we can get this close. Got a really good chance at birdie on this one. Sitting about 6 feet. Dang, I really wanted that one. Oh well, two putt par, on to number nine, see if we can't get this back. Hole number nine is a 370 yard par four, but severely 
dog leg to the right and uphill in a second shot. We're just trying to get this somewhere in the middle of the fairway and give us a good shot in. Apparently that's how you hit a good drive. You step through it, then hike your pants back up and rope it down the middle of the fairway. Don't try this at home. I'm a professional. Second shot in the number nine, severely uphill blind shot. I've got 135 yards. Let's see. Ooh, put a good move on that. That is tracking right at the flag. This could be good. Hit that to about four feet. We need to grind over this one, make this birdie, get back to one over. Good stroke goes in, birdie, waves to the crowd. 37 on the front nine, we are in good shape. Thank you so much for watching and joining me on this front nine. My first time out in 2022, shooting 37. Come back next week, we'll wrap up the back nine, see if I can hold on. Don't forget to get down there in those comments, leave me a comment, let you know what you enjoyed. Hit the like, hit the subscribe, it really helps me out, it doesn't cost you a dime. This is the Diesel. Thanks for watching Swing Like a Gorilla.